Verse 4. It's, this is the issue. Say, for while one said, I am of Paul, and another, I am of Apollos, are you not Cana, Paul says? So let me ask you that question today. Why one of you says, I am of Pastor Chris? I am of Oyedipo. I am of Adeboye. He says, you are carnal. This is the Bible. Remember, Jesus did not start a denomination. There's nothing wrong with denomination. These are administrative means. As a matter of fact, I was raised in a denomination. I was raised in Christ Embassy. And Pastor Chris is my spiritual father. But I am not denominational in my mindset. Now look at what's going on here. Like what's happening everywhere today. People are typically fighting for men of God. Not for the truth of God. This one says, one says, I am of Paul. You would expect that Paul should celebrate. No, Paul was heartbroken. The other says, I'm of Apollos. You say, I am of Matthew Ashima Lowo. I'm of Samadayemi. I'm of Kojo Yemade. He says, you are carnal. I see some people write the most absurd and immature things. I stand with Pastor Chris. What nonsense. You have to grow up. Now look at this. For why one says I am of a deboy and the other says I'm of a yearly the other says I'm of Pastor Chris says you are canal. Verse 5. Who then is Pastor Chris? You see, he writes here, who then is Paul? Who then is Adeboye? Who then is Ashimolo? He says, but ministers. What do you mean ministers? Servants of God. But ministers by whom you believe. Praise God for Pastor Chris, by whom I believed. Praise God for Adeboye, by whom you believe. Thank God for Yediko, by whom you believed. They are servants, ministers of God. And look at what he says here. Even as the Lord gave to every man. So God has given a man of God to every man. Praise God. Thank God I located Pastor Chris. That's why I'm here today. He is my man of God. He is the servant of God that planted for me to have a foundation in the faith. But he, that does not in any way diminish any other minister of God. I do not stand with Pastor Chris. I stand with the truth. That's the Bible. Praise God. Verse 6. Paul says, I have planted. Apollos watered. But God gave the increase. You see, in your journey of faith, let me address this issue. Many, you can have many mentors, but you have one father. Your father in the faith is the one who planted. Is the one who planted. It's not the one who watered. The one who laid the foundation. For your Christian faith is your father. And you cannot have two. I have Pastor Chris Oyakilome. Thank God for him. He will always be my father. But I have many mentors. I have many teachers. You see, I'm going somewhere. All things are yours if you think kingdom. But only a few things will be yours if you think denomination.
He says, I have planted, Apollos watered, but God, this is the real thing, but God gave the increase. You see, in your journey of faith, some of you, the ministry that brought you into salvation, in your work with God and his specific vision and calling for your life, you may not continue to be there like myself. And there's nothing wrong with it. But you do not leave the body of Christ. And <clears throat> I know that there are ministers who raise, sometimes ministers incite followers by making shady remarks. And that is carnal. You see, in your work with God, one minister or one ministry may plant. Another ministry or minister may water. But however, it's God that gives the increase. It's God that gives the increase. And now let's read this. 